welcome, welcome, welcome. I am Moonam, aka Nikki Love, your African indigenous traditional healer. And I want to welcome you to the Moonam Spiritual Society. And today we're going to give you a brief description of the Bangdule divination mat and some information on the mat so you can you know, use it yourself. One of the oldest forms of African divination. A lot of people used to use tarot cards and everything else, but I uh, we got something that we need to start using, which is really fast. So, tune in while we get ready to show you how to navigate across the mountain and the nation. Okay, um, I got a question so we, people can see how accurate it is. I do have, uh, I'm gonna say a question. Uh, I have people trying to do things to me so i just want to see what do you see with that what do you see my enemies are trying to do okay all right all right all right ancestors what is your mother's name melva 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 see through me speak through me ancestors of melva and ancestors of ogun chola speak through me see through me speak through me see through me Give us an accurate read on this map for the answer. Oh, inshallah. Want to know. Wow. Okay, let me just say this. Now, this map covers astrological, cosmology, and the four cardinal points of the earth. So, with this map, you're going to get an overall reading with this map. It's not like tarot cards where you just pull them out and you get it, you know, you're getting the astrological answers, you're getting the uh, cosmic answers from the planet, okay, from the planets. Now, as you can see, the first one, you really need to focus because what the, okay, let me just explain this, what this is going to do is going to tell you about yourself as well as give your answer, okay? Okay. So, we see that this shell right here it falls on the green side, and they're saying that uh, Jupiter, the planet Jupiter, guides your path. It guides your path and helps you with success, okay? Mm -hmm. And you need to tap into your higher spiritual self, okay? okay? Now, when it falls on this side, the green side, this shell means money, means mm -hmm. money, okay? So when it falls on this side, you also need to refer to Jupiter to get guidance and success for your money. Because have you been having money problems? I wouldn't say money problems, but people, my enemies are trying to block my money. Yeah, because it's, They don't want me yeah. to have money. So you need to go to Jupiter and, and, and talk to Jupiter about helping you with that situation, okay? And and also tap into your higher spiritual self when it lands on Jupiter, okay? Right. Now, you have... You have... This is representation of the actual... Uh, human element, okay? So this falls here, okay? Now, when it falls right here, it says highly spiritual immersed from water, immersed from the elements of earth. So you are a spiritual being. You mm -hmm. need to tap more into your spirituality. You understand? More into your spirituality. This represents the male. And, it, the, and, and the red side is saying that you've been pretty negative about your own thoughts, your own self, okay? You I can to... be at times, sometimes. Okay, all right. Now, when you come over here, there's a female that's around you. And this female, it says in this slot right here, being being mindful of enemies, spiritual work and spells, chaos and evil, high priest is a priest. So this is a woman. This represents the female energy. This is a woman who is doing work. That's the enemy right there. Okay. And she's doing negative work. As you can see, it lands on the right side. When it lands on yeah. the right side, it means negativity, okay? Yeah. This woman may be a Scorpio or has Scorpio energy, okay? Because you see, this is the astrological, right? Mm -hmm. now, so it could be somebody that is doing the work. Well, actually, I'm sorry. Let me correct that. Are you a Scorpio? I'm a Scorpio, yes. So it lands on your it lands on Scorpio. So the red side means negative. So the energy that she's putting out is very negative, almost like trying to really harm you, okay? Okay. Now, this one falls on the actual L. Do you know a woman that is a Libra? Um, yes. Yes. 
Um, really? Yeah. See? So, uh, my Actually, my daughter uh -huh. is a Libra and my... Um, Am I, uh, no, I'm sorry, not not a Libra. I'm sorry, I'm thinking about uh, something else. No, Leo. not a uh, uh, Le. I got a uh, not a Leo, but a uh, Virgo. Virgo, a Virgo. I meant. So this person, this this right here, it falls on a uh, Libra. Okay. Now that could be somebody that she's surrounded with, though. You mm -hmm. understand? Okay, that's actually helping her do the work. If that's not her, okay. There's a, over here, let me see this. This is Cancer, Gemini Cancer, okay. These come up right here. That's basically people that surround her with those astrological signs, okay. Um, this one right here, ancient wisdom, ancient being, physical, existent here a thousand years or more. This person also has been here a long time, so her soul has been incarnated more than once, okay? Mm -hmm. But she's also a disagreeable spirit. You see the red side? Anytime yeah. you see the red side fall up, that means negativity or evil, okay? So, yes, you do have enemies. You do have an enemy. Now, this right here falls on the fire. This person right here, very evil, very, very evil. Fiery energy, okay? Mm -hmm. Very fiery. And then this says right here, these stones will fall up on the negative side. Oh, she's trying to cause you obstacles. She's trying to cause you obstacles. Um, trying to take your body, soul, and your mind. Mm. Okay, spiritual and physical being, duality, body, soul, and mind. So they're working on you. You do have a lot of enemies. That is right. I do got a lot of enemies, and you're out actually uh, very accurate because they are trying to uh, do work to actually take my soul or kill me and harm me. They're trying to do a lot of things. They've been trying for seven years. Okay. Well, let me, <laughs> let me just get to this right here. This right here, this represents the actual um, divine feminine energy, okay? Mm. Feminine energy. So this, they better be careful because you are surrounded by divine feminine energy, higher forces, which could be, you know, powerful witches or, mm -hmm. you know, some know them as the army or some people call them different. You understand? Bush, Bush, but you are protected by the feminine energy to a certain extent. So they better be careful. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, that's pretty much it to wrap it up. But I just wanted to do this so people can get an idea how to use it. it and it comes with a book as well family it comes with a book with more in-depth reading uh reading to it so when you go through the book it'll tell you it'll give you hold on it'll give you the actual meanings of and let me just share this real quick the meanings of the uh different astrological signs okay so for example Capricorn, that means this, this person is born a shaman, should be practicing shamanism, also the power over the animals. Now, let me go to Scorpio. Since yours came up with Scorpio, let me just share this real quick, okay? Because yours came up with Scorpio. Now, the Scorpio actually, hold on, y'all. I'm going to get to it, get to it, get to it. Okay, this is Scorpio, 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 Scorpio. Okay, here it is. Okay, so Scorpio which came up with you is, it says this person should be dealing with esoteric practices, also practice in tarot and divination. This person has an internal psychic antenna. Is that true? Are you practicing? <laughs> are you yeah. Pra yeah, you are? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I right, practice so a couple of forms of divination. I'm just um, really honing in on an another one. And this one, I'm practicing this one in another form. Okay, well, there you just go. Just trying to hone in on it. There you have it. All right, family. So. If you are interested in purchasing the Bangdule Divination Mat, you can go to our website at wunamandadinkwa.com, and that's W U and is in Nancy A M and A N D Adinkwa A D I N K R A dot com. And you can purchase the Bangdule Divination Mat, which consists of cosmology, of astrology and the four cardinal points of the planet, okay? And also guided by the Divine Mothers. I see. Thank you for tuning in.